welcome to my exciting life it's very exciting right now i'm studying hello i'm pretty sure you did not expect me to start in the kitchen but yes i am in the kitchen because i need my coffee so i thought it would be better if i film while i am making the coffee instead of just listening to a lot of bts songs so yes today is 11th of august i did not film last week because i wanted to have a sweet break from youtube so it's not like i have been a lot on youtube i just started like two months ago but yeah i wanted a break so anyways i did not film the last week but i did manage to mess up everything that i wanted to do so i haven't really been exercising i haven't really been dancing i haven't really re uh, read the ncert which i was supposed to read i did solve a few questions i actually solved a lot of questions it was just me sitting on the bed and solving random bio questions it's not like i did chemistry and physics i did bio only <sighs> So today I'll be studying for in bio I'll be doing questions in chemistry I am going to do mole concept and chemical bonding revision so I'll be just solving questions related to that hopefully I will do that and for physics I think I have to do dual nature of matter I think yeah so I'll be focusing on three lessons today um just a sec I cannot wait for dynamic to come out. So it's 1:48 p.m. and um, I had been a bit distracted, and I did 
procrastinate a bit and i have completed like 71 questions from this thing which is very less because this lesson has a lot of question in it and i am only done like So it's around like 230 questions something and I have done 17, 71 questions. Yeah, so that's not a good thing. But that's my fault that I got distracted. Um, anyways, I had lunch and then I was like, let's just do something that's going to make me happy. Um, the thing is, I am currently in that phase where... I am just like, I don't want to study anymore. This is boring and this is tiring and this is useless. I don't even know if the exam is going to be on 20, 13th of September or if, or if it is going to be postponed. It. So yeah, I am in the mindset where I am just done with this. I am just like, nope, I don't want to do this. So uh, The thing is, there is a group of students who want to postpone the exam once again. Um, I'll be honest here, I'm not with them, I'm not against them, I am in middle, I, I'm just in bet between like, fine you want to postpone it, if they postponed it, okay, I'll just take some time for myself and then I'll get back into the study mode, but if it's not going to be postponed it, then I'm going to be worried that I have to go out on exam day and I have to wear a mask and I have to wear gloves and then I have to write the exam there sitting in a room enclosed with random people I don't know going through the same tension of exam and the environment yeah so why am I smiling so much today uh, I don't know <laughs> yeah that's that's the thing i actually think i should stop doing this lesson now also i've been feeling demotivated because of this and other things going around so i think it will be better for me to journal a bit or just make a little vision board kind of thing somewhere in my room maybe right over here because now that this wall is empty, I am free to do anything with it. So during my boards, before my boards like started, um, I made a little vision board underneath the glass of my table. So I had a um, few quotes. I had pictures of my friends and me to just give me that small motivation, give, make me feel happy. And um, I had quotes and I even had BTS's photo cards under this. Yeah, that was a part of my vision board. Um, so I'm thinking I'll do it in this week because it's better to make it early so that I can look at it every day in morning. Also, this wall is right in front of my bed. So every day that when I woke, wake up, I'll be able to see that and then I'll be like, yay, I have a reason for my life right now. Yay, I need to study. Yay. Yeah. my specs for the first time okay this will be a bit better i think um first thing i solved a lot of physics question which was very boring but enjoyable because i was listening to music at that time and i made a small vision board kind of thing on the wall over there so it's always in front of me so that's probably going to help me I don't know I was planning to make it up here but I ended up putting up there um, I think I'll still put a few things over here because I wanted to have something here as well so that I can see it in morning whenever I wake up and 
in morning i am mostly like uh, i have to do this all over again so yeah <laughs> i think that might be helpful to me so i'll do it sometime later and i am very tempted right now to take my kpop journal and make a spread including the teaser photos that came out yesterday i am so so excited for that i cannot wait for the single to drop can bts just do it quickly <laughs> they always have to put out something whenever i am supposed to be doing something very productive and it's a common trend now every time whenever i have an exam they just decide to launch out something yeah this has been going for a long time now anyways um what are they saying i was saying something yeah i had been um doing the questions after that i made the vision board thingy and then i took a big of break and then i was like let me just edit this video quickly and my phone is dying right now because it's on 4% it can just die any time so yeah i'll quickly just charge my phone and i'll start with chemistry now because i had done enough of bio and physics yeah that's all Good morning. It's 12th of August today and it's another day of studying, revising and not enjoying the life. Uh today I'm starting with genetics, which is not a bad thing because I really love genetics. I enjoy studying it. But the thing is, I have to study genetics for next 4 days, so I have divided the two chapters that I we have in four part so i'll be doing those so today i'm going to study mendelian genetics which is the most easiest thing in genetics so yeah then chemical bonding like yesterday same questions i'll practice more of them today and for physics we are starting with atoms and nuclei i don't mind studying that lesson it's fun i actually enjoy that that one lesson in physics <sighs> what's wrong with my head Don't do it. Um. Yeah. That's that's all in this. And as I have planned, I have to do bunch of things every day. So that's more to my to do list. And something different that's going to happen today is me and one of my friend. We are going to study together. Um. So we are not going to meet anywhere. We are just going to call each other on Zoom and study because. She will be studying. I will be studying. Both will look at each other and we'll be like, "She is studying. I need to study." So yeah, that's going to happen today. Um, we are going to do it at one p.m. So I have a lot of time before that. So I will just finish the daily to-do list thing that that I have, and so that way I can study genetics when she will call me. So we will. Then okay, the desk is also clean now, so it's better if I just start with the. I had been solving questions for physics for um for a long time um and in between I took a break to have lunch and I am going to take another break right now because I need a break <laughs> physics is not very nice subject that I'll just continue with another one I'll need a break so I am going to take a small break and I am going to now Take take my K-pop journal 
and um, make a small spread like very small spread i'm going to make it very quickly hi guys are you so sure you're going I to am make going a kpop spread or you're going to go on session Insta that i'm going to do with my friend Ari. and now she's staring at me through the laptop and let me just tell you i could not finish making the kpop spread but i did make a reel so if you want to check it out go on my insta not Danish Diary, but Bangtan Army Girl, which is my other Instagram account, which is of BTS special things only. So go out and check it. Out. Um, no, go and check it out. I'll link it down below. Now I'll start with studying again. I'm going to do a bit of bio, as I said, genetics today. So yeah. Hi. Um. So I am currently standing in my balcony because it's pretty nice out here. Um. I studied for bio for like two hours now. Me and my friend we were studying, um, and now I'm going to do a bit of dance practice because I need to be very active. I have been very not active for the last one week or two. I don't remember. But anyways, I'm going to start with dance practice now. I'm starting with fake love this this week, so. Okay, now that I'm done with dance practice, that didn't go well. I had been practicing for an hour and a half now, and I couldn't even learn the starting part. So, yeah. But anyways, I'll just need to practice a bit more, then I'll be able to do it. Hopefully, <laughs> it's not like I'm going in some competition. I'm just learning it for my own sake. But yeah. Now it's time to start with chemistry. I had done bio, I had done physics for today, so I need to do chemistry now, and then I'll just do things that are in my different to-do list of you know the daily things that I'm going to do. I'm so busy. Anyway, <laughs> good morning. It's thirteenth of August today, and. Um, there's nothing special for today's to-do list because I'm doing everything that I did yesterday once again. Not like same topics. I'm not doing the same topics and same questions. I'm doing the same lesson but different content from that. So yeah. And today the Wi-Fi isn't working because it has been raining a lot since three days. And when I say raining a lot, I mean it has been raining a lot only at night, not during the day. During the day, it's just very cloudy and it's hard to tell what time of the day it is. I'll say that I haven't seen sun in like three days now. <laughs> Anyways, so due to this heavy rain, the Wi-Fi isn't going to work for a long time, and I stay in an area where the network has a lot of issue. That's the whole reason why we have a different Wi-Fi. <clears throat> so it's not going to work. And network is not going to work, so I am stuck doing questions from my books, which I haven't touched uh, from a long time now because I had been depending on the sites only. So, and tomorrow I might be traveling, so if that's the case, I need to do a lot more today than usual, because tomorrow I tomorrow also I need to do genetics, which is going to take time. And unfortunately, that is the lesson which I have trouble with. The second lesson, molecular inheritance one. So I have trouble with that a little bit. So I am going to tra travel tomorrow. I need to make sure I revise that today itself, and then tomorrow I can just solve questions while we are traveling. <sighs> some reason I just feel like this lesson is very easy but I do tend to mess up the questions for this and only thing I am having trouble with in this lesson now um, are the Mendelian disorders because I just keep on messing up between autosomal recessive and autosomal dominant and um, yeah 
for some reason i was also confused between hemophilia and what was the other one there's hemophilia and sickle cell anemia so i keep kept thinking that they are the same thing whereas they are not and that was very stupid of me to think that so i'm going to make some yellow flash cards for for the mendelian disorders and maybe for other disorders that are in the book because for some reason i just keep messing it up i keep thinking of a specific disorder to be some other kind of disorder so yeah i should probably keep a little flash card flash card flash card booklet so yeah yeah so i agree quickly wanted to say that i did copy everything but i did not vlog it of course because i needed to just focus a lot more on studying or i needed to do a lot more today so i did not vlog today but i did study i did dance practice i did random stuff as well great thing for me um yeah Hi vlog so it's 14th of August and I am in a bit of hurry so I am just going to quickly tell what's going on uh, we are going to go at uh, my relatives uh, place and my friend stays nearby my best friend stays nearby so I am going to go meet her as well so it's going to be a one day trip we'll be leaving within like 15 minutes I'm ready to go as you can see and um what more yeah i'm trying to be professional youtuber <laughs> Sunday, sixteenth of August, and it's twelve fifty-eight p.m. So it's like one p.m. right now, and I wasn't going, I wasn't going to vlog Sunday as usual because even though I say it's a weekly vlog, it's never a weekly vlog because like at the end of the vlog, I don't really film a lot, so it's like. Okay, then I went to one of my relatives' house this Friday, and then since my friend lives nearby, I went at her place, and we had a lot of fun, and we met like two years. After like two years, we had some fun talk and some gossip, and like we made some brownies, and those turned out very tasty, and I enjoyed that. I wanted to get few clips from that, but I did not because like we met like two years after, and I wanted to spend as much as time I could have, so I did not really film. And one of my friend joined us, and he brought us ice cream. So I had the ice cream, and um, <laughs> didn't really went well for me. I had a b very bad throat yesterday, <laughs> but now I'm okay. Um. I think he will be watching this video because I told him about my channel. So if you're watching, thanks for the ice cream. I really enjoyed the time with you and our little friend. I don't know if I should mention their names, but I did ask my friend. She said it was okay, but since I don't have any clip, I don't feel like I should be. But yeah, I enjoyed that time, and uh, then we stayed over at my relative's house. because it was very late for us to leave and um when i stayed over i slept at like 1:30 which wasn't really ideal since i sleep very early and wake up around like 5 that is my schedule and it has been like that for like 2 months now so sleeping at 1:30 wasn't really ideal for me i wasn't feeling well yesterday so yesterday we then i woke up at like 7:30 so that's very less time of sleep but yeah then we traveled for like 4 to 5 hours and we got home so in car i was like okay i'll go home i'll drink a cup of coffee and get back to studying 
but that did not happen since i came back home i had some food and then i was like i'm going to sleep so then i was like okay i'll sleep i'll get up early in some time and then i'll study but no that did not happen i woke up around like 5:30 so like i slept around like 12 and then i woke up at 5:30 and uh, you know the day was already kind of over for me so i decided to take some time for myself look at my life think about it connect with some friends and yeah i did that <laughs> and then i came to conclusion that i want to see what i can do with my channel currently i can't really do much but of course i can do little things so i'll be working on some little projects as well which is not ideally nice but since when i study i take breaks so breaks i can use that time to do something much more productive rather than just sitting and watching random videos on youtube or igtv so that will be better or watching the reels which is very addictive for some reason i tend to like keep watching them so when tiktok was out i used to watch tiktok for like hours and then i would be like where did the all time go so around that time what i did was i deleted tiktok for a month yeah i did that and later on after like a month i downloaded it back and it wasn't the same i did not like keep watching tiktok for hours i did not even watch them even though i downloaded the app so i don't know that just kind of works for me i delete a app and then i stay without it for like one month and after some time i'm just able to not use it for unless reasons like useless reasons So I did the same with Insta few months ago, and that worked for me. So if you want to like get rid of some random app you don't want to use, you can definitely use this trick. It kind of works. I had did with this with like Insta, WhatsApp, and TikTok. So if you want to, you can do it. Another thing is I'm starting my bullet journal, new bullet journal, in middle of August. And now you guys might be like, okay, you made a whole damn spread for August and September. Why do You want to start your new journal right now. The thing is, even though I have the spreads in this, they mainly hold my schedule, like what I want to do, what I'm going to do for this month, and the trackers aren't really working right now because every day I start the day with some planning, reviewing what I'm supposed to do, then I start studying, then I start doing. the actual task and getting over the task and then i'm like okay i'll just check the task off and i forget about the trackers <laughs> okay so that's the thing i forget about the trackers which i used to do like enjoy doing every night i was always excited for i uh, filling up the tracker but right now that's not the scenario because at the end of the day i am just exhausted because i have been solving bunch of questions every single day which is not something i really enjoy doing so at the end of the day i just want to be sleeping <laughs> so yeah that's one thing so i'm going to be starting with this because i want to make sure i have detailed to do list of every single day and now you might like you might be like you already have a diary for that i have my reasons okay the diary is already very thick i cannot keep it on my desk and if it's not on my desk i'm not going to look at it that's the issue with me so this bullet journal ensures that i will have my to do list and stuff on the desk itself because that bullet journal just consist of list it does not give me any idea of how my week is going to look so like i hope you can understand what i'm trying to explain um but yeah and i was kind of worried about doing this at first i was like you know you are a youtuber now and your life should be looking very perfect and pretty but let me be honest here i'm not that kind of person who is going to make illusion in front of you like yeah my life is very perfect i am very you know um i'm very pretty and perfect and i have everything organized i have everything done and i am very awesome no that's not the kind of thing i'm not that kind of person who is going to make a illusion in front of me uh, sorry in front of you i 
if you might have seen my previous vlogs you know i tend to make a lot of mistake even when i'm speaking and i don't really cut them out because like this is what i am this is how i am i'm just the way i am i'm going to be like that and i won't be creating any illusions so as like you know it doesn't matter if i make another bullet journal i have two bullet journals at the same time um i don't think it matters because if it's going to help me it's better for me then it's totally fine for me to do it and you are the view viewers i know and i should be thinking about you guys as well but currently that's not the scenario it's a bullet journal i can have any any amount of bullet journal at the same time and be using them but yeah since i have been on youtube for a long time i have been following very um famous youtubers so there are few i realized that they have trouble because they have made this illusion of themselves as being perfect with their bullet journal and being so it kind of influences their planning and stuff their bullet journaling methods it influences the people and i realized that since i have started because i have been trying to like think about the audience as well but to be honest that kind of does not work that kind of does not that thing does not help us even though if it helps the viewers it's not going to help the actual person who is doing it so if you are also following other bullet journeys don't don't pressure them to do something they don't because like when people comment in the comment section the person has to take it in their account like okay my audience also want me to do this so i have to do this don't do that because it kind of influences them and makes them like not be themselves so okay <laughs> that was something i wasn't expecting to talk about but anyways um so i am i was like about to start this and i wasn't going to film this but here i am filming it anyways so um i just wanted to end the vlog properly so yes that's why i'm here i made a new timetable because my previous timetable had only physics plan physics and chemistry planned until like 15th of august so i needed to increase that i needed to make a new plan physics and chemistry so my plan is right over here i hope you can see so i made it today i kind of have one chapter every day so then physics chemistry why i have one chapter of each subject again and uh, yeah this is this will be like final revision of every chapter in detail and once september start i'll just stick to solving papers and doing the topic wise revision of everything so that's my plan and i did not expect this to be so long it's like 14 minutes already i have been talking and i'm pretty sure this video is going to be long as well so i promise you this will be the last video which is going to be super super long hopefully i think i have talked about everything i wanted to so i should probably stop right over here okay so <laughs> let's end the vlog here i just wanted to say thank you for watching this video if you enjoyed if you liked it please please consider subscribing and um, you know you might also like to hit the thumbs up button so like please like it and if you enjoyed please subscribe and if you are one of the most wonderful person in the people in the people in the world <laughs> and um, if you share this video i will say you are few of the most wonderful people in the universe so please do that okay bye i need to stop um bye 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 bye